elephants in the house? Or at least can you draw some horses? Yeehaw! This is gonna be interesting. I'm suddenly inspired. I've always been more of a unicorn gal. Unicorns are stupid. Get it together, Gina. Now let's get to work, okay? I'm following my own strategy. Just a few folds this way. And then comes the drawing part. Connect both sides with an arch. And keep drawing them until it looks a lot like this. Okay, this ought to be enough. Open sesame! Okay, here's where things really get interesting. Draw this shape exactly like I'm doing. It'll be clear soon. Don't stress. Now we're going into the next section. And do the same on the other side. Very nice. Are things starting to look familiar yet? Yep, it's a unicorn face. But we just have to add a few more features. Loving those gorgeous lashes. Don't worry, all these lines will make sense at the end. Especially when I get going with all the fun colors. It's a unicorn after all. This may take a while, but all these clean single lines make for a smooth streak-free finish. Hey, a patient artist makes for a great artist, I say. Just gotta trust the process. Phew, so now it's done. Time to fill in the most magical part of the unicorn. So the more colors, the better. Nice combo here, don't you think? Last one. It's perfect. Whoa, drawing utensils down. Show me what you've got. Okay, here goes nothing. Well done! Huh? Here's mine! Oh my, oh my! You two are talented artists! Picture sure is cheery. Good enough to be framed. And why stop there? Just need some inspo. Mm-hmm. Right. You said what? Oh, Susan, you're bad! Ugh, I don't know. Um, excuse me? My paper! Oh, my bad. Oops. Look what you've done! It's ruined! Hey! Can I show you something? Ever hear of a happy accident? This is one of them. Oh. Me? Yeah! You can do different sizes, too! Amazing! Let's do it! How many do you think can fit on here? As many as you want! Things are getting crazy! You can use pretty much anything. As long as it's circular, of course. You think we've done enough yet? It sure looks cool, doesn't it? Up high! My little artist. Painting, you might be my most favorite one of all time. Ah! Grandpa! Watch out! Don't knock over another one of my paintings! Seriously, that could have been a disaster. What if he had actually brushed against it? Oops. Look at that! I got paint all over my suit jacket! Oops! My painting! No! Oh, what a nightmare. I couldn't stand it if that had happened. Oh, I think I've got another great idea. Excuse me, Gramps. I'm gonna need this. Okay, I've got the hairspray. Now to put it to work. I'll just add a layer to my painting. It's gotta be enough to actually coat it all, though. There. Now that it's dry, it's completely protected. Look, no paint came off at all. It's finally safe from grandpa mishaps. Oh! Hey, you are right! It worked! There's nothing on my jacket! Phew! Good thing I thought ahead. My painting is safe and sound. Yes! Another toilet paper tube! Come with me and complete my tower! Yes! My castle is almost done! It's glorious! Grandpa? Are you in here? I can't find my glasses! 
I can't see anything without them. I'm practically blind. Stop waving your arms around like that. No! My beloved castle! It has crumbled! All my work has been reduced to cardboard tubes once more. Listen, here are your glasses. Take them and be gone. You sound upset. What happened? <laughs> All my dreams have come to an end. He looks so sad. Hey, wait! What if I could fix things? I've got a toilet paper tube. Now I'll just fold it so it lays flat. And then slice it into circles. Perfect! It worked just like I planned! Now for the next step. The glue gun. I'll just add a little dollop here at the end. Good! Now I need a second ring. This one will do. I'll glue this end to the other end. Good! That's just how I wanted it to look. Now to continue on and keep adding more rings. There we go! I've made an entire circle of rings! Now to add even more, in between the first ones. There we go! And now I'll paint it with this pink paint. Grandpa! Look what I made for you! I know how much you like art! What? You made that out of toilet paper tubes? I did! And look! It can hang right here on the wall as decoration! There it goes! So, what do you think? It's astounding! I love it! Okay, this spot looks substantial. Yeah? The trees, nature, what have you. The heat is on! You bet! I don't know… What? Hey, stop looking at mine! Whatever, fine. I'll be over here then. What can I paint? Bingo! He's adorable! I hope David didn't see him. I saw it first! Uh-huh. May the best bird painter win! A few skillful circles can go a long way. Just have to know where to add the lines. Nice, right? But some color will really make it pop. Yellow is such a happy color, isn't it? It's perfect for such a cheerful guy. And how about some green? Such a peaceful hue. And add some blue for a real treat for the eyes. Doing the edges first is always best. It really rounds things out, doesn't it? Almost done! Just a couple of finishing touches. And that's how it's done, folks! A true masterpiece! Don't you agree? Yep, I'm pretty pleased. What is that? I just needed an extra hand! Turns out, a hand is all you really need. Well, that and a few strategically placed dots and lines. Can you see the bird face yet? Don't worry, it'll all come together soon. These branches ought to give it away. And here are its cute little feet. A little greenery? I think it's quite peaceful. Can you see the bird now? I'm just so creative, aren't I? Well, if you really want to see it… Not too shabby. Oh. I guess they're both pretty great. Should we ask the teacher? Seriously? I hope he's okay. Seems like he's just fast asleep. Hey! Ooh. All done, huh? Oh, great job. Now just give me, uh, five more minutes. Alrighty then. I need something that'll turn some heads. And I know just the thing. Complimentary hues for the win! But it's still missing something. But what? Ugh, this ball is so dinky. Whoa! That thing's blowing my mind! Mom! Oh, not now. Okay. You still have a lot of paint left. Which leaves room for me to play. Thank you! I just don't know what to do. Okay, I'll try a little. 
Hey! Where did my paint palette go? David? Is that you? Excuse me? Look! I did this! I call it pond water. Uh-huh. Oh, I know. You want to face paint? Give it a try, David. Whoa! Again! Fun, right? You can say that again! Yeah? What if I use my finger, too? Incoming! Ha! Blue dots coming in, people! But now for my favorite color! Woohoo! That's it! Look, mom! Well, isn't this incredible? But let's try one more trick. Symmetry can sure be beautiful! And to prove that to be true, you created it all on your own! It's a gorgeous butterfly! This line will really make it come to life! Along with the outline of the wings. Other side. There. Just admire this pure beauty. And that's just the beginning, son. Okay, I think this piece is finished. I don't want to get ahead of myself, but I think this might be a masterpiece. I'll just set it over here on the easel. Wow, I love it! Ooh, bubbles! I think I deserve a bit of a reward! Yes! Look how many there are! I love bubbles! Hey! I'm back- Oops! I knocked that painting off! Oh! It was my masterpiece! The best I've ever done! Wait a second, bubbles? This gives me a great idea! I've got a plastic bottle, I'm gonna cut off the top. And now I'll stretch a little net over the opening. Next up, I'll pour soap into this glass tray. That should be enough. Now to dip the net end into the soap. Now the soap has stuck to the nut. Time to add some paint to it. I'll drip some blue. Some red, too. And then yellow, of course. Primary colors. Check. And now it's time to start blowing some bubbles. I'll just make sure I'm close to the canvas. And now I'll pop some of these bigger ones. There we go! I think the work is done. Hey, what do you think about this? Whoa! How did you do that? I just took inspiration from your bubbles. I made it for you. Thank you so much, grandpa! I love it! Bubbles are truly great! I just need to staple these papers and that's my homework finished. This is actually fun! Huh? Uh, uh, it must be jammed. Whoops! No! That might be a problem. That's it! All done! Now I can relax. Stupid staples! Ugh! That's gonna be painful. Oh no! This is the crime scene now. Stay right there, okay? No press! Get out of here! David! La la la, ooh yeah. David! That is one good cup of coffee. I hope this works! Where did that come from? There's a message. SOS? I wonder what's wrong? What's this? What? Staples? My AirPod case will solve this. It'll pick up all the staples. Just like this. I think I got them all. Thank you! Well, get some new art! Yikes! No thank you. No! Another rejection! Ah! Stranger! Help! Attack! Calm down. What's up? No one wants to buy my artwork. Grandpa, what are you even doing in that trash can? What do you plan to do with that garbage? 
You still don't trust me? Well, okay then, you'll have to watch. I'm gonna set this lid down on paper. And now to start spray painting the paper. I just want to coat the whole thing. Don't be afraid to cover the lid. And now to add some white paint down here in the corner. Want to just fill this whole space. And then it's plastic bag time. I'll dab the white with this bag. It'll pull the paint up a bit. There we go. And now I'll speckle it with some more white paint. Time to take the lid off. There we go. It's done. Ta-da! Wow, Grandpa! It's incredibly beautiful! I can't believe how easy it was for you to make this! Here, you can have this. I want that painting! Take all my money! I take my cleaning job pretty seriously. Okay, time to check it. Spotless. Just as I thought. But there's a lot more to do. I need to finish this classwork. Ugh. My pencil's broken. Luckily, I have this sharpener. This is quite dusty. Huh? Huh? Chew! What the? Not on my watch! It was an accident, I swear! I've got it, see? Wow, that was intense. Oh, I have an idea. But I need an empty bottle. Okay, let's get creative. I'll start by removing the bottle cap. Then I'll cut a hole in it. Next, I'll flip the cap over. And apply glue around the edge of the hole. That should be enough. I'll stick the sharpener to the bottle cap. Once it's set, I'll screw the cap back onto the bottle. That's just what I need. Now the bottle will collect any debris. There's no more mess. I'm watching you. There's nothing to worry about. It's all in the bottle. Hmm. That boy will go far. Go for a swim with the fish? Ooh, definitely. The ideas are flowing. That makes one of us. Huh? How is Gina so good at drawing fish? Hey, Gina! A ghost! <laughs> there! What? Oh, you're in for it, David. I won't let this dampen my spirit. A real artist can create something out of anything. This design can totally work. It's all about thinking outside of the box. Or, well, the fish tank in this case. And they don't all have to be the same. They each have their own style. See? But a little color can really make the fish come alive! See how I'm using my line technique? Just fill in the scales that way too! The outline keeps everything in place. Now I'll use the same technique on the other two fish. But with different designs, you have to change the color scheme. And this bad boy's going mellow yellow. But a dash of purple will really make him stand out. They are complementary colors after all. But turquoise is always my favorite. That's why I save the best for last. Orange always goes nicely with blue. What should I use for the middle color? Yellow, of course. It really brings it all together, doesn't it? Color plays a huge part in this piece. Makes it really eye-catching. Fish really are fun that way. Almost forgot about the bubbles. All done! Give me those fish! Huh, may as well give me first place. I guess it's alright. How about yours, Gina? You mean these old things? Very nice! Well, that plan sure backfired. Ah, uh, how did this yarn get tangled? Wow! Grandma, look! Ah! Oh, my! My yarn! What a mess! No, 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 no! My art! It's totally ruined! Grandma, look what your yarn did! Wait, the yarn? The yarn! Of course! It's already in the paint after all. 
I'm gonna do this! All right, the black paint is on the canvas. And now for some gold-painted yarn. I've draped it across the canvas, and I'll do some more over here. There we go! All around the entire piece. Next up, I'll need to tape down the unpainted yarn ends. Ready? Time to pull up the canvas! There we go! The yarn's coming right off! This is an amazing piece of artwork you've created! You're definitely grandma's best artist! It's the best painting I've made! It's just very scary. <laughs> Get it? Bear? Uh-huh. I know how to spice things up. I feel you, David. Now fill her up. Ah, some for you. And some for me. You're welcome. Smells good. Mmm. I don't see any drawing. Whoops. Whoa! Water rings! That's too bad. Maybe I can do something with these. Hehe, <laughs> talk about a happy accident. Just have to add some extra shapes. And it'll turn into something awesome. Time for adorable ears. Then we'll move to the body. Can't forget about the little arms. The face makes it come alive, see? And the colors are easy to pick. Especially with the name Brown Bear. He looks a lot like the teddy bear I used to have as a kid. These lines give it a bit of a furry appearance. Gotta fill in the legs too. Perfect! And he's so cute! Ahem! <clears throat> Markers down, people! My, my, my! We both went with teddy bears! <laughs> Great minds think alike! Ah, <sighs> she's so pretty! Time to see if I can impress her with my talents. I'll start with this blue. But I'll also need other colors, too. Definitely gotta fill this heart with pink, of course. There! She's gotta get the message with this painting. I wonder if she'll like it. You made that for me? Oh, get it out of here! Ouch! Nope. I don't want that reaction. Yeah, this is garbage. Wait, what? Oh no! I've got paint all over my hands! This day is not going like I thought it would. Better wash the paint off before I make a mess. Definitely gonna need some soap for this. Wait a second. Wow! Look at this! The suds are colored with the paint! Time to redeem myself! I've got my bowl of water and my dish soap. And of course, I have to add some paint, too. Time to mix this together with a popsicle stick. There we go. It's getting a little sudsy. But I need more bubbles. Time to add some air with a straw. Wow! Look at all of these bubbles! They just keep coming! All right, so long, straw. Now to add the paper onto the bubbles. Just like that. Wow! The bubbles appeared on the paper! Hi! I made you this card. You made this for me? Wow! I love it! It's so beautiful! Oh my gosh! Wanna walk me to class? It totally worked! Time for the next challenge. Oh my gosh! A unicorn! I'm so happy! Whoa, dial it back a little. I need to hang out with new people. What are you doing, Chris? <clears throat> I'm Princess Sparkles, ruler of the Rainbow Kingdom. Sure, this is a different look for you. Stop, you're ruining this. Let's spin the wheel. This is so awesome! No hands, no problem. Here goes. I'll put mine behind my back. That's actually a good idea. Hmm, I thought this would be more difficult. Not bad. Finished! What do you think? That's certainly… something. What do you know about art? I'll show you how to draw a unicorn. Let me just check the scale. Oh, yeah, I, I always check the scale. Definitely a unicorn. What's he doing now? Hmm, I think I have a plan. This should make things easier. 
start with a sheet of grid paper. And start to draw the unicorn. It may look a bit funny at this stage, but trust us. That looks good. Once the outline is done, start to fill in the middle. This is a really good way of drawing something with a lot of detail. Using grid paper allows you to scale up drawings. And it helps to make drawings easier. Time to add color. If only coloring in was this easy. Let's get some more colors in the horn. I told you we knew what we were doing. There! My own unicorn! Check this out! It's good, right? How did you do that? I mean, mine has colors in its hair. <sighs> At least you tried. I know. Hey! What do you think of my new jacket? I totally got it on sale! It was 50% off! Isn't it just the best? Yeah, it's nice. I get it. But check out my new jacket! What do you think about my new phone case? Sparkles are so last year. I've got poppets. Whatever. I have this notebook, too. I decorated it with stickers. Hearts and stars and one little ice cream treat, too. What? Ugh! My notebook is so boring and plain. This isn't gonna work at all. There's gotta be something I can do. Hmm? I've got these markers. Wait! I think I've got a plan! I've got markers on this knife. I'll cut off the tip. And then I'll make a few more cuts so it'll look like a heart. Aw! Look how cute it turned out! And now to bring out my notebook. I'll use it like a stamp. I don't have to stop at hearts, either. There we go! I've got hearts and stars now, too! See? My notebook has that, too. And I didn't need stickers. Whoa! I can't believe you made that! Okay, I'll press the button this time. I wonder what it's going to land on this time. Ooh, a tree! I didn't expect that at all! Wait, I got no hands again? Let's see what the magic gives us for this challenge. Oh, I guess we've got a bottle of ink and a… straw? Well, guess I should get started. Time for you to show off your stuff, elbows! Great job! Now let's open the bottle of ink! Yes! Okay, good thing straws are actually made for the mouth. Alright, now I need to use this to get some of ink, I guess. <gasps> it's working! What the heck am I supposed to do with this straw? Oh no! She's drinking it! Stop! That's ink, not soda! Uh, what? Oh, phew! I thought you were drinking it! I'm drawing the only way I can. Just gotta keep blowing this ink in the direction I wanted to go. Wow! That's turning out amazing! I can't believe you can do all of that with a straw in your mouth! Ugh! Why isn't this working? Maybe I just have to blow even harder into the straw. Come on! Come on, you dumb ink! Phew! Wait, what's on my face? Aw, I got splattered with ink! What's she crying about over there? Ugh, she's a total mess. Wait! Huh? Stop! Why? Look! I've got this pink paint! I'll just squeeze a line of this paint out. And now for another color, too. Okay, I've got my paint lines. Now I need a cotton swab. I'll dab it in this light pink color. Now watch! I'll just dab it again, but on your black inky branches. See? It looks like flowers! Like little buds that have opened in the spring! Look at how great this is turning out! Isn't it beautiful? Wow! You really helped make my tree even more special! I'm so glad we worked on this together! Me too! It's lovely! I've got a good feeling about this one! A love heart! It's so cute! Let's see who spins the wheel! I'm great at thumb wars! Yes! I won! Oh, so close! Please don't be bad. No paper? But how am I supposed to draw? Guess you'll need to figure that out. Watch this. I'll start by drawing a line down the middle. And another one. Then some lines at the top and bottom. And now for the sides of the heart. The pencil makes great guidelines for when we start to use ink. 
Once the basic shape is done, use an eraser to remove the guidelines around the edges. Then grab a pen and just follow the lines. It creates a great 3D effect. Now to add the color, remember to stay inside the lines. Once that's done, add shadowing to the inside edges. A regular pencil is fine for this. Just add to anywhere you think there would be a shadow, or where you think the light would be different. It's a different way of drawing a love heart, but it looks so impressive! That's it! What do you think? Wow! I mean, it's okay. What can I use? I know! My hands! It's pretty basic. There must be something I can do. Got it! A tiny heart! Huh? How about this? It's a heart! No, it isn't? Sorry. Okay, now what do you think? Ugh, just give up! I know I can do this! Come on, fingers, don't let me down! I think I figured it out! I just need a red pen! Place one finger on top of the other, then draw a love heart. Then simply use a red pen to fill it in. It's not too bad. I like it. Or should I say, I love it. But I'm not finished. Let's add a smiley face. And you need another one for true love. How romantic! Look! Seriously? Aw, that's so cute! Hold on, I have an idea too! Don't ruin it. It'll be great! There! They're hugging! I think I'm gonna cry! It's so sweet! Oh, what a good night's rest! Time to brush my teeth because morning breath is gross. Shoot! I dropped the cap to the toothpaste! Ugh, where did it go? It's too early for this. Now I have to get on the floor just to find this dumb cap! Where is it? Where did it go? I'll just reach back there and see if I can pull it out. Got it! Wait, lipstick? Gross! Maracas? Was someone having a concert? An entire hand mixer? I don't even want to know why that was under there. Shoot, no cap though. <sighs> now my hands are all dirty from being down there. Yep, filthy and dusty. Better clean them. Time for some soap to really clean my hands. Wait a second. I think I'm coming up with an idea! Gonna need my tube of toothpaste, of course. And I'm gonna need a cutting blade, too. Time to start cutting the tube! I'm gonna cut the top off the toothpaste off. I'll take that top away because I don't need it. Instead, I'll be using the pump like with the soap. It slides right in. A perfect fit! Now my toothpaste tube has a pump top. With the pump top, I'll never have to worry about losing the cap again. It makes the perfect line of toothpaste, too! Wow! This turned out to be super handy! Here we go for the next challenge! Oh! It's a bunch of paint with makeup blenders! They're so squishy! Hmm. Maybe I should check my makeup. Ooh, I could definitely use some touching up. Yeah. Me too, Sky. Oh look! The wheel! Look! It stopped on the beauty blender! Yay! And we've got these long canvases to work on! All right, those are ready to go. Now for the hands! Oh man! No hands for either of us this time! Time for paint! Ow! My head! Ouch! Okay, we gotta be more careful. All right, I've got some yellow on my blender. And now I'll dab it onto my canvas and try to get a straight line. I think I'll start with this light blue. And now to start painting onto this end of my canvas. Now I need to add some orange to the yellow I've already put down. Time for some light pink now. I'll put it on this side of the blue. I'm gonna need this pretty sea green color. This is kind of fun, right, Lexi? Okay, back to work. I need some of that green right in this area. I gotta keep blending these pinks together! Yes! My ombre effect totally worked out great! Wow, it's so beautiful! And serene, too! Phew! I'm finished, too! That was a lot of work. Whoa! That's way different than what I made. Wow. Well, did you see what I did? Lexi? Look at mine! Yeah, yeah, it's great, Sky. I just… Whoa! H how did you even do all of that? Yeah, thanks. It totally turned out just like I pictured in my head. 
Well, now I don't know how I feel about mine. Listen, don't be sad. We can zazz yours up. We'll use this daisy. We'll just put it face down on your canvas. And now we'll get some white paint on the beauty blender. Time to put some of this white paint on the edges of the petals. Oh, wow! Let's do another one up here. Wow, Sky, You made it even better! I love mine now! Look at the patterns the petals made! They're so pretty! You're welcome. I'm glad I could help. I expect to see you on your best behavior during the test, and you can begin. Okay, I know all of this. I know none of it. Maybe I can fake a heart attack. Nah, that's silly. Chris? No talking. Oh, sorry, miss. Hey, Madison. What? I'll give you this candy bar for some help. You know I love candy. Okay. Here you go. Awesome! I should have thought of this earlier. The answers! Looking for this? Yeah, that's what I was looking for. Hey! If you want this, give me the answers! I already helped you! You're so annoying! Incoming! Really? This belongs in the trash. She did, did it! it! Did not! No! So. Nuh-uh! Such a liar! I'm teaching vegetables. I just want to read my book. Let's try this again. Hey! Hey! What now? See this candy bar? What about this one? Yeah, you got a deal! Hmm, how do we do this? Aha! I know! I've got it! Open the notebook and place a strip of tape down the edge of the book. Repeat this across the page. Next, take a sponge and cut it into small pieces. Stick a piece onto a highlighting pen. Now you have a handy eraser to wipe off anything you write. No one would ever know. Hey, you want the answers? Watch this! What are you doing? Hold on! There you go! Great, thanks! I would've never got that answer. What's going on up there? Oh, nothing, miss! See? I must be seeing things. That was close. Hey, give me the candy bars. Pleasure doing business with you. I love this song! Oh, Jennifer and her love of bad music. You should hear the beat on this verse! Also, this gum is great! Bubble time! Oh no! What happened? The gum is in Ava's hair! What am I gonna do? Okay, maybe I can just carefully pull it out and she won't notice. She's looking! Play it cool! Oh no! She's itching her head! She might touch the gum! Oh, thank goodness she didn't find it. Phew. Close one. Okay, time to try and get the gum out of her hair again. There has to be a better way to do this. Wait, wait! This drink might actually be the solution! I put ice cubes in my drink to keep it cold. Hello, you special ice cube. You're gonna save my friend's hair. I'll just carefully put this ice onto the gum. Perfect. Now the gum is cold enough to pull off without it sticking. Oh, thank goodness I got it off her hair and she didn't notice. And now I have my gum back too. Eh, maybe not. I'll just leave it here for now. Ava didn't even notice a thing. I'm like a ninja gum remover. Great practice, guys! That feels better. Wait, should I have notebooks or something? There. I need that thing that you write with. Uh, um, uh, a pen! That's it! Nope, not under here. What am I gonna do? Hey, smart girl. Yoo-hoo! Me? Yeah, can I borrow a pen? Okay, I should have an extra one. That one. Sweet, thanks. Oh no, it's broken! Hey, smart girl, this one is faulty. Can I have another? Be careful! Wow, two in a row! Uh, you're not gonna believe this. Take it. Here. Have this one. I hope she kept the receipt for these. Psst, 
Smart girl. This is my last pen! Okay, fine! Wait a minute! This juice box could come in handy! Maybe the straw could help. This'll do. Take a pen apart. Apply some glue to the bottom of the ink tube, just like this. Next, take a straw and slide it over the ink tube, all the way down to the glue. Pens that look like straws? No one is borrowing these. Wow, these are so cool! Can I have a pen? These are straws. Sorry. Fine. Hey bro, you got a pen? Yes! Now I can get back to my work. What well, we'll have to draw next? Oh, it's a flower! All right, let's do this! Ugh, this flower is harder than the fish. Maybe with one of these colors? It's so pink and pretty, though. I've got it! That's the solution! Right into this color. The black. Now I'm ready to capture this beautiful flower. I don't know what he's doing over there, but it's weird. I can definitely paint this flower, though. I'll just do one petal at a time. Now for the inside layers. This is turning out pretty good! Done! So much easier than the fish! Oh! Our time's up! Here's my flower painting! It captures all the emotions I feel when I look at it! Here's my flower, Yeti! No way! Yeti likes mine the best! This flower is just so beautiful! Time to eat it! Today's subject is… The Puppet Unicorn! Ooh! Last one to finish is a loser! I win! Yes! I win! La -na. Ready? Please, I was born ready. This shouldn't be a problem. Need to win faster! Go! Come on! I will win this easily. Prepare to lose. Ha! Yeah, right! Almost there! Uh, true art comes from… Uh, forget it. Gotta keep going! My pencils! Can't use these anymore! These are done! Don't need these! What is she doing? Last section! Come on! I need to do this and I've won! I need more pencils! Ugh! How's he doing? Slow and steady wins the race. I can't let him win! But I have no pencils! Wait. She doesn't have any pencils left. I'm gonna regret this. Let me see that. There must be something I can do. Hello. I have a great idea. This straw might be useful. Take a drinking straw and insert the pencil nib into it. Do the same at the other end. Now you have a pencil you can write and draw with. I can't win that easily. Hey, these are for you. Pencil! This means I can finish my drawing! Thanks! No problem. Wait. Start in three, two, one, go! No way! A tasty-looking burger! Oh gosh, this is gonna be hard. Gotta make sure my scale is right. Ugh, that's not working! I know! The ruler will help! Okay, I've got the measurements. Now… Oh, what medium to capture it with? I've gotta make the right decision! Ugh, I'm running out of time! Pencil it is! <laughs> the clear best choice was chalk! I've got the bun! Now for the ketchup and lettuce and mustard! Can't forget the burger patty! And the bottom bun, of course! Wow! This turned out great! Hmm. Oh no! I wish we had more time! Ugh, this is the furthest I got. 
Yeti! Look at mine! What do you think? Hmm. Yes! I think he likes it! Wow! But wait! This burger is encased in ice! How am I supposed to eat an ice cube burger? <laughs> Your burger is a block of ice! And next up, we're going back to the basics. Oh, shapes? I know what to do! Look at all that confidence! Watch and learn! That gives me another idea! I can totally do this too! See? Looks the same! Well, kinda. Why doesn't mine look like hers? How does Naomi know what she's doing? Can't give up now, just keep going! Oh! I'm impressed! Hard to see it before the big flip, but it's all about patience. Hers is so much better than mine! Don't be so sure. But Naomi's does look good. And that's why she's the winner! Now! Yes! A pizza! Of course! This one should be way easier. I'll need a good reference picture. That one's perfect! I'll trace the shape. Okay, I need to draw the pizza with this marker. I think I've got it! Here I go! P-I-Z-Z-A! Huh. I think it needs something more. Ooh, what if I do something like this? I'll just connect the letters here and here. Now to just add toppings. Coloring time! I hope I win this one. I'm hungry. Time to make this cheese yellow. Pepperoni time! Oh! Our time's up! Yeti wants to judge! Oh no! I feel like I just got started! Well, here's mine. But it's not done. Here's mine, Yeti! I hope you like it! Yes! I won this round! And there's the pizza! Wow! It's huge! Time to fold this whole thing in half. Wow! This looks so good! Here I go! Wow, Thomas! That's pretty impressive! Mom? Sounds good, right? I guess that can't be hard, right? Brown is just the right color. It's on! Everyone knows how to draw a cupcake, right? These look like something different. We both did the poop emoji, see? It's awfully cute, isn't it? They're looking good! Just gotta make those baby blues. I need to fill in the body. They're really coming together. But girls, that's not quite a cupcake. Art is all about interpretation. Let's flip these bad boys! Boom! We did it! And they're both fantastic! And? Um, I don't know. I guess you both, well, lose. No winner? Hey, come here! Yeah! Let's get out of here! All right, ladies, we've got your party food. That, uh, doesn't look like food. Suit yourselves. Hey, sir, care for a snack? Geez, fine. <laughs> Hi, friends! Let's get our grub on! No? 
know, on second thought, <laughs> at least we got rid of one! Wanna split this guy? Done and done! Mmm! Not bad at all! Especially for something shaped like this. A unicorn! Hmm, this might be tricky. I'm going for the pens. I don't know, so many options. Paint… Or pens. Pens! I think this is the right choice. Okay, here goes! Oops! My pen slipped! <laughs> Sorry! Oh, it slipped. Okay! You're so immature! Let me help improve your drawing! Don't you do that again! I warned you! I improved it! Oh, you missed a spot! I'll help you color it in! Gah! This is pointless! Take that! Quit it! Stop it! We could do this all day long! Take some more paper! Fine, but I'm facing this way. I'm gonna draw the best unicorn ever! Got it! U. N. I. C. O. R. N. Now I just need to join it up. I'll give it a nice hairstyle. Can't forget the legs. All I have to do now is color it in. Pink will be the perfect color. I think this will win. I wish I had a real unicorn. All that's left is the tail. Done! That was easy. Ta-da! Oh no! Here's my drawing. It's good. Well done. I wonder who won this round. <laughs> well, I'm shocked! Yes! What the prize? Please be a real unicorn! I can live with that! This won't do. Too small. Let me see. Aha! That looks so tasty! Maybe I could try a little piece. She won't notice. This is what I need! Stand back! This is about to get messy! You didn't! Sorry, I tripped Jana. Uh, landed on the cake! I saved you some! You're unbelievable! I offered. Ready, girls? It's unicorn time! Do your thing! Should I do the horn first? I think I'll just wing it. With a steady hand, what could go wrong? Gah, I'd better start! It's too soon to see which is better. But there are two different approaches here. Either way, there's definitely magic happening. Okay, they're coming together now. Can you tell what they are? Ah! They're still busy. Some color ought to bring these things to life! Look at those gorgeous hues! Yep, they look pretty good. Mine's better, though. Definitely different. And now for the final fill-in. Yep, it's almost finished. But it still could use something. Wait, I can't let hers win. There. Hey! What are you doing? I must've slipped. Hey, do you smell that? My pancake! It's totally burned! Oh man, it's completely ruined! <coughs> Ew! Stop it! I feel kinda bad. May as well flip mine over. Still looks pretty good. Stacy's definitely the winner here. What do you think, mom? That's awful. That makes Stacy the winner. At least you tried, Naomi. I've got a good feeling about this one. Well, that's disappointing. 
I thought this was a challenge. Okay, what should I use this time? Too big. Nah, I'm not feeling it. This is perfect. A pumpkin should be straightforward. It's an orange circle. I need to win this one. Okay, this'll do. I'll start with the sections, then the stem. Now to fill it in. A different shade and color will make it look good. I'm happy with that. What do you think? Hey, wake up! Hello? Yoo-hoo! Wake up! We're supposed to be drawing! I'm awake! What's going on? Oh right, the pumpkin. Great, time's up! This is the best I can do. You've got a little something on your cheek. Really? What? Aw, paint. It suits you. Yes! What's the prize? Mmm! Pumpkin juice? This isn't nice. I… I feel funny. What's happening? Do I have a pumpkin for a head? Ah! At least you have a costume for next Halloween. <laughs> I hate this game! Ah! My face! My beautiful face! It's back! Oh, sorry, I got a fright. I'm never drinking this again. Hey, keep it over there. Ready for the next challenge? A cactus? You're going down! I doubt it. You are. Go! This should be easy. Gotta keep my energy up. Feel no stress. You're one with the pen! I nearly finished! Done at last! Phew! Spot the difference. It's hard, isn't it? What is that? Watch and learn. I'll drag the sponge down the paper. Then use smaller sponge for the limbs. Now for the flowers. All I need to do is add some details. I might frame this afterwards. What do you think? Well, they're both green. Don't give up the day job. This isn't even gonna be a contest. Wow! A cactus pinata! Think there's candy inside? Only one way to find out! I'll put on this blindfold. Okay, time to work out some tension. It's glorious! Look! Huh? Did you say something? Where did she go? Hello? <laughs> Meh. Her loss. What happened? <gasps> hey! Where did this candy go? 